Hello everybody, welcome back by a new video and today it's time to react to the ugliest and worst fixtures ever, in your opinion. So the lamp channel is with me too and we are going to react to them. Um, I looked at the uh, through the list and I barely know any so that's going to be interesting. <coughs> so before we start, lamp channel, what do you think is the worst looking fixture? Uh, far as I know, the DG Street, because it's unlikely the only fixture uh, and the Axia I know from them, and Axia 3, 3, are uh, not quite sure how it looks, so it's going to be a surprise. So let's start googling the Axia 3, which was a fixture a lot of people requested, and I, I know how it looks, and yeah, it looks dismal. So here we have the Axia 3, which is this. Oh god. Um... I'm gonna give my opinion. I really think I think it's no. I I, I don't even have words to describe this. It's, it's very ugly. I've, <laughs> especially the smallest version looks terrible. I think it's just a <laughs> like if you took the Aksha, which already isn't that beautiful in my opinion, and you just like let it design by somewhere a very cheap weird company <laughs> that has never made a fixture before and doesn't have a taste. I think then you get this. The next fixture is the Schreder Isilum or how you're supposed to pronounce it. Fuck. <laughs> I misspelled it. Didn't get any results. <laughs> ah, here we have it. And what do you think of this? What, what even is this? Looks like an, uh, uh, one, a cheaper version of the DG Street or something. I don't know. I don't know even what to... It kind of is the opposite because, you know, the back of the fixture is wider than the front but yeah um, i don't um, like and also the led plays look ugly what the fuck is that <laughs> who designed that it, it looks it's, cheap it's a very cheap design i think but it's like almost every single company that goes really backwards you like you used to make very nice fixtures but it's getting worse like every basically every company yep citeco sq or something oh god no oh, that oh. that thing Oh, it looks yeah. like a cheap version of an arc or something. <laughs> yeah, it indeed. Looks... E. Yeah, I don't know who designed this again. I think I'm going to say that a lot of times, but it's just no. Uh, uh, it's no, very it's... ugly, especially for a fixture that isn't LED. It looks absolutely terrible. It's a really it's... cheap version of an Axia, an Axia arc. Yeah, it is. Cut. It is. Hmm. Same brand, but the SR version, and I kind of disagree with this thing. I don't think it looks that terrible. And it looks like it, oh, again, looks like a cheap version, of the more like an SGS or something. I don't know. I think that the, these two versions are fine, like the one with the flat ball. But I don't know what this is. I, it's just, uh, it's just, yeah. I mean, it's fine. In some fixtures, it's fine, but... In some pictures it's fine, but in some it looks terrible. I don't know. I also see this other fixture like a circle or something. I don't know what this is supposed to be. I don't know either. Maybe it's the next one. Which is the Citeco SL. Why not? Oh, it's spicy. <laughs> a spicy take. Um, I know someone that really likes these fixtures, but um, I agree. These look... I don't know... Is this a different fixture? Because I think this one looks worse. Often this I think that the flatter version looks alright, but with the thick back, it what the fuck is that? That looks terrible. Oh. And I've seen these in real life in Germany, oh. and I despise them. They look terrible. I agree with this take, yeah. It's disgusting. So the ASD Highway Diamond. <sighs> Oh god. Oh, oh what is oh man what is this? Why is this face so tiny? <laughs> man, how is this a highway? God. Highway diamond, man, the fixture is Oh my god, what even is, is this? Big as as a leaf or something. Man, this thing is oh tiny. Oh my god. What is this? The photo cells almost bigger than the entire fixture, man. This this is the best one so far. Man, what oh. is this? Wow. Yeah, this... Uh, I definitely wouldn't, don't want to see these 
in my city. Like, if I would see this, I would directly move to a different city. I, I don't think I want to see this. The bigger version looks better a bit, yeah, but, but still bad. But this thing, man, the photo cell on it looks, makes it look way worse. I mean, it's like twice the size of a photo cell. What is this? Uh, this is... Philip the Didi Streets. Which we have a lot in uh, our city. Yeah, this fixture kind of ruined our city. Um, and placed a lot of beautiful fixtures. Um, I'll directly say with the fact that the this one, this version where the fixture is hanging on a cable looks quite nice actually. I don't mind this, but I think any fixture would look nice in this form. But yeah, <laughs> the rest. <laughs> yeah, the rest. Um, I hate, I just hate these, but I don't know if that's because of the fact that they replace so many fixtures, so many beautiful fixtures, or just the general fact that they look ugly. I think it's a combination of both. I think if we wouldn't have these fixtures in the city, they would be f all right, I think, but I hate these because they replace so many beautiful stuff here. Yes. The Torn Civic. Uh -huh. Oh, that's this thing. Yeah. I used to dislike these fixtures because I remember seeing these in Sweden, but um, now I think they are all right. They aren't very beautiful, um, but mm, they are all right, I guess. Hmm. Not big, I'm not the biggest fan of these fixtures, but it, it's not that terrible. I mean, comp especially compared to the previous fixtures that were, oh, this one looks yes. nice. Torn CV tech or something. Well, uh, LED. Yeah, well. It's not. It's not actually a flat fixture. It's actually. Yeah, that's a pretty thick surprising. fixture. I don't know. It's just like a brick or something. I don't know. Yeah, it's very basic design. But um, are there images of these on the streets? Oh, there they are. Oh, that. Hmm. Hello, oh fuck. Illegal site. I don't know. Uh, oh yeah, this no, 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 this isn't very good. Looks like a, a, a thicker version of a decay or something. I don't know why. No, I don't know what it is. They looked fine on the pictures, like um, where they are on the, on the street, just the general pictures they used to advertise them. But outside of that, I think the bigger version looks fine to me. Um, I don't like the fact I like the fact that they aren't as flat as some fixtures are. But um, the tiny version is too tiny again. They should stop making these fixtures so tiny. Philips Alu Road, Alu Road. Mm. Uh, I can't find them. These aren't the Alu Road, I think. These are just some food lights, aren't they? I don't know, looks like we can't really find these anymore. So the TRT Aspect oh. Mini. E. I've seen these on Instagram a lot of the times. Um, and yeah, I, I absolutely agree with this one. It's, it's it's really it's good. everything I hate about a fixture just in one fixture I mean it kind of looks like a digi street and also very cheap LEDs as far as I can see on this these pictures that why is the top of the fixture black and the rest white why would you do that and it's also it's very just... tiny it's just just a combination of like all the terrible things we've seen so far, just in one package, packs in one tiny fixture, yeah. And this one. I have no words for this. Oh, uh, Zetalet Solis. Um, I think it's... Uh, what is this? The one we are seeing on the pictures, but I'm not sure. It's like on a solar pole with just one big LED and some random cooling, which is probably for the driver. Okay. Yeah, this, this one's. I mean, I get that they want to do experiments with those solar poles, but they always end up being. The fixtures on there always end up being just looking terrible and just. 
I don't know, there's something very, uh, something that just doesn't look good in my eyes about those solar things. I mean, yeah. you can have the solar pole, but just put normal fixtures on there instead of this crap. This is, this is a Chinese fixture or something, I don't know. But... Yeah. The Windsor Kirium Pro or something. Uh, mm. Hmm. What is this then? These kind of look like the uh, fixtures they installed in a town near the city where we live called Sun, which is the Philips name for high pressure sodium bulbs. But you see the, the town is called Sun and they put up light bulb candela fixtures there and these kind of look like them. Yeah. I think these are fine. These aren't as bad as the ones we've seen before. But I also wouldn't be very happy with these installed. No. Well, I think they look fine. I don't know, this one looks cheaper than the rest. But, I mean, in my opinion, these are fine. I'd rather have a finished fixture installed, but... Mm, yeah, these are alright, in my opinion. Yeah. And someone else suggests, like, all the Chinese, cheap Chinese fi fixtures, and yeah, I agree. Some of those look absolutely terrible, but um, it's not really a specific fixture. But what do you think is the worst looking out of them all? Or I think you the um, list? that uh, very, very tiny fixture, the ASD Highway Diamond, I think that's probably the worst one so far. It's yeah. Just, it's, it's way too tiny. I don't know. I just don't like it. But the TRT the aspect was also very tiny and looked yes. even worse. I think that's my the one that i think is the worst yeah. but the, yeah I'm, I'm not so sure i'm just i just think this is still asd it's just um way too tiny it's, it's just it's, it's just big enough to uh for the leds and that's it like that's what i don't like about fi these fixtures i also think that the xcr3 is just it's just the biggest disappointment ever that a company likes right there as popular as they are, make something this ugly. I think this, the XCR3 is worse than anything Philips has ever, ever made up, up to this point. Yes, yeah, I, I quite agree. But it seems like all those companies are going backwards, so who knows what's, what the future holds for us. But yeah, thanks for watching. Subscribe to the Lampos channel. Um, Link to his channel will be in the description and also if you have any more recommendations put them in the comments below and maybe that will make a part two and uh, thanks for watching have a nice day and see you in the next